Hi, I am Michaela Ackerman, and I am the property manager at Grand for Apartments here in Salem, Oregon. I'm Sarah Crawford. I'm one of the housing coordinators at Salem for Refugees. Hi, Hi. Uh, my name is Katir Yusuf Isaac. I'm from Sudan. My name is Romana Ibrahim Yaya. I'm from Sudan. arrive here in Salem, uh, they land in temporary housing, um, either at a, a host home or a hotel. Um, as soon as they get here, we start looking for permanent housing. Granfer is unique because we have a, a really close partnership with them. We have over 20 families now at Granfer because it's just been so great. They've been so great to work with and, and our families love being close to other new neighbor families. I don't think I've ever seen more of a, a, a melting pot of cultures, if you will. People literally from all over the world learning languages from each other, uh, learning new games from each other. I think that the engagement between the cultures has really been amazing to witness. Adults are often enrolled in English classes and so they have been able to carpool. When it comes to getting to, our off to and from our office on the bus line, they're able to teach each other. I think that what makes this property unique and what makes affordable housing unique in general is the families that live here may not be afforded all of the luxuries that um, other households have maybe. Uh, when the kids get home from school, they're not coming home and playing on their game consoles or their Nintendo Switches. They're getting home, they're helping with their household chores, they're getting their homework done, and then they're playing. They're coming outside and they are spending the entire evening outside riding their bikes, riding each other's scooters, uh, you know, learning with each other, playing with each other, learning games from other cultures, uh, they're everywhere. <laughs> to, to live in a community like Grand Fur and know that there are other families here that know what they're going through, they've been there, they, they understand what that's like. Last week, the Eritrea woman, you know, her husband, you know, the big son, he make accident. Yeah, me and he, he go together, the place, he make accident. Before the doctors, doctors he come, me, he take the small boy, he go, before me, I come to home. I have plenty of friends, my children, to like this ferment, you know. Yeah. I have a lot of friends, and friends with her. And my other friend live over there. And my other friend live up there. And my other friend that one. <laughs> and this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I like this home. Yes. Yeah, nice home. It's what living in community with new neighbors can look like and, and how everyone in the community benefits, not just our new neighbors. Yes, I like this place.